Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Analysis You don't have to be smart to get rich. This has long been a response from business people to academics, especially economists. An excellent question and it is becoming increasingly clear that it applies to business people as well. The link between earnings and IQ, which admittedly is only a measure of intelligence, is just not that strong. The evidence is striking. A study of CEOs of large Swedish companies found that they ranked on average, in the 83rd percentile of measured IQ, that is above average, but there is hardly a cluster at the top of the distribution. Many CEOs have undoubtedly achieved their position through hard work, charisma, people skills and other skills. Not to mention luck.one study concluded, that rising from the 25th to the 75th percentile of IQ was associated with a 10% increase in income to 16% correlated. This may feel important to understand, but it doesn't push you into a whole new socio-economic class aces. It is difficult to say why this is so, but one possibility is that the smartest people prefer a more balanced life rather than working full-time. Or maybe they prefer jobs with higher status and slightly lower pay. Money isn't the only thing you can enjoy. Perhaps a lot of this makes it harder to trust potential boyfriends or spouses. With most investments, there is a trade-off between risk and return. This means that if you want any chance of superior returns, you have to take some risks. Once risk and luck come into play, it is easy to see how two people of equal skill and intelligence can produce vastly different outcomes. Citing luck as a factor is not intended to belittle the achievements of business people and investors. Even getting into a position where luck can net you an extra $5 billion takes remarkable skills. That is, between a person who is worth $1 billion and one who is worth $6 billion, the assumption that the wealthier person is smarter isn't very strong. As you might expect, the results are not the same for every country. In Finnish data, income does not fall for those with the very highest IQ. 